The Federal Executive Council has approved the National Poverty Reduction with Growth Strategy, submitted by the Presidential Economic Advisory Council. Special Advisor to the President on Media and Publicity, Femi Adesino, disclosed this while briefing State House correspondent at the end of today's FEC meeting. Tai Amodu reports. The federal government is trying hard to reverse Nigeria's new reputation as the poverty capital of the world, with over 29% of its population unemployed. The COVID-19 pandemic has further worsened living conditions, and this national poverty reduction with growth strategy is expected to bring an improvement in the fortunes of all citizens. Vice President Yemi Oshibajo, who heads the PEAC, is to chair a steering committee to provide overall guidance for its implementation. Council also approved the implementation of the strategy and its incorporation into the medium-term National Development Plan 2021 to 2025 and Agenda 2050. Council noted the worsening poverty situation in the country and the efforts of the federal government to redress that situation. It's not as if government is not aware that there's poverty in the land, but things have been done. And one of it is this national poverty reduction with growth strategy that was presented today. The Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice is to prepare a bill for submission to the National Assembly to ensure the implementation of the strategy. There would be a Nigeria Investment and Growth Fund, NIF, NIF Fund, that will be set up to support the national poverty reduction with growth strategy. Council also approved a memo from the Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs seeking an augmentation of a contract for procurement of poultry for Bornu and Plateau states, Lot C5, in the sum of 60.2 million naira. This revises the initial contract sum from 1.238 billion naira to 1.298 billion naira, representing a 4.87% increase in the original contract sum. Tai Amudu, TVC News, Abuja.